Bart the Daredevil has such a great message in it, but it's also a lot of fun and a really entertaining episode as well. This is the eighth episode of the second season of The Simpsons. This one's directed by Wesley Archer and originally aired in December 1990. And in this one, The Simpsons, after spending quite a laborious evening at Lisa's recital, they go to a monster truck show, which is not something I would have expected Marge or Lisa to go to, but, you know, the family had a very interesting outing, to put it mildly, and Bart suddenly decides that he wants to become a daredevil. And for the first time, we actually get to see Bart properly using his skateboard. Obviously, in the intro sequence, he uses his skateboard, but until this point, he's only ever kind of dabbled with it, but now he's really using his skateboard and is threatening to do some pretty dangerous stunts. And a lot of the episode is him training for that, but also various family members trying to encourage him to not do that because it is a very ridiculous, stupid thing that would risk his own life. And it's quite a sweet episode because you see his family members worrying about him. They're not just chastising him for doing something annoying or stupid, although it is stupid, they are actually genuinely concerned about his safety and show this love and affection for him. There's a very sweet moment with Homer that I'm not going to go into too much detail about in case you haven't seen it, but I thought Homer's attitude was really lovely and I really thoroughly enjoyed that aspect of the family all actually worrying about Bart and fearing for his safety rather than just getting on at him for being a nuisance. It's also something that I think a lot of younger viewers can relate to. In fact, scrap that. I think it's uh, maybe a lot of people can relate to this. Some people in older life or, you know, when they hit middle-aged or whatever, they may suddenly decide that they want to start doing stunts or they want to live life to its fullest and experience this great adrenaline rush, which, when done safely and under supervision, can be a really good thing. But obviously, if you're trying to just jump across the canyon like Bart on a skateboard, Maybe your family need to have a word with you. I thought it was a lot of fun. Um, we got to meet some really interesting characters. I really liked it. I think I'm surprised they didn't spend more time at the Monster Truck Show. Not that I think they they didn't spend enough time there. I just guess I would have expected them to be there a little bit longer. But either way, I really thoroughly enjoyed Bart the Daredevil. We have had a couple of episodes that are mostly about Bart back to back. And these first two seasons are definitely very much focusing on Bart and Homer. Lisa and, and Marge do obviously get a look in and every now and then they will have an episode that's mostly about their concerns or problems or desires. Maggie doesn't really get a say in anything. But for the most part, we are seeing mostly Bart, which I guess makes sense with kind of the target audience, the merchandising. But is it a chicken and egg? I don't know which came first, Bart or the Bart fans? It seems like a ludicrous question, but either way, I can't complain too much because it works and it's good fun and I love this episode as well. Definitely not one of my favourites, but I think it's really strong with a really great message, a really nice um, approach from Homer. Bart the Daredevil is pretty great.